Welcome to Complex Hustle, I'm Brian Hanley. This video might feel a bit like Inception, and that's because today we're gonna to be talking about how to actually make videos like these. Video content is king in digital advertising. According to Cisco, by this year, video content will account for nearly 70% of all web traffic. What does that mean for you? It means if you're not creating and marketing video content on social, you're falling behind those who are. No matter what you're selling, entrepreneur Gary Vaynerchuk explains, no matter what your company does, if you don't have a video marketing strategy for the biggest video platforms, you are going to lose. Here's everything you need to know about creating compelling video content. Too many people give up on video because they assume that they need the most expensive equipment to give their videos professional look and feel, but they're wrong. According to one of the most successful YouTube creators of all time, gear doesn't matter. A number of top vloggers shoot everything on their smartphones and even critically acclaimed movies like Tarnation, which grossed over a million dollars in the box office and won countless awards, was made with a total budget of $218 and edited using iMovie. The point is you don't need professional cameras to capture killer content, and you don't need proprietary software either. If iMovie's all you have, take advantage of it. Casey Neistat, for example, still edits using Final Cut Pro, which he admits is inferior to software like Adobe Premiere. But Casey, like many of us, is a creature of habit. He'd rather keep working with something he knows well, rather than starting over with something brand new. In terms of narrative, there's no surefire way to tell a good story. But you wanna find a topic that your audience is interested in, and then share it with them in a way that they're also interested in. The only way to acquire and retain subscribers who truly value your channel is to put out content that people care about over and over again. The most difficult part about all this is editing, says YouTube and Instagram creator Crispy Shorts. A good editor can turn dog shit into gold. And in the same vein, without good editing, even the greatest piece of content can go astray. A lot of YouTube creators like to start their videos with a time lapse, usually one that's set to a fitting music track. The way Casey does it is he takes a time lapse of some urban scene, and then he matches the footage with an instrumental that suits the mood. Then he edits that time lapse so it's playing in regular speed until the moment the beat drops, at which point the time lapse switches to a much faster speed so that it flows in sync with the instrumental. Casey Neistat revolutionized internet vlogging by bringing a higher standard quality of content to the table. A staple of any Casey Neistat vlog is the time lapse, which he uses both to further the narrative or set the time of day. Casey also likes to end his vlogs rather abruptly, and he says he does this because it's more satisfying for the viewer to watch. I hope that was helpful for you. If you're an aspiring filmmaker, YouTube creator, however you classify yourself, um, okay. Aside from that, Casey likes to keep his format really loose. Arguably the most important lesson here is that you should find a style that works for you. YouTube and virtually every other platform out there are saturated with video content. In order to stand out, you're gonna have to stay true to yourself and of course, your hustle. For more stories like this, be sure to subscribe to Complex Hustle on YouTube. Stay tuned for more business and technology news. For Complex Hustle, I'm Brian Hanley.